What's up dudes and dudettes, it's your man Evan B here, uh, broadcasting again from the Butt Cave. And uh, tonight I've got a special video for you. I'm actually uh, filming this probably uh, maybe a week before I'm going to post it. But uh, what I wanted to do was show you guys the blaster that I made for uh, your buddy and mine, uh, Fala from Blow No Nerf. Um, this was a, a whole lot of fun to do. Uh, I want to tell you that right now. I, he's uh, messaging me as I film this. Um, I just let him know that uh, he's going to need to check the mail because uh, this bad boy's coming. So uh, without further ado, I'll, let me uh, let you know. This uh, is totally a gift from my buddy. Um, and so there was a lot of love put into this. Um, and we'll just go ahead and crack into the review. Um, First, you'll notice that I uh, I got a, a pretty sweet little gun case for it, which fit this blaster perfectly. Um, and, and we'll just crack into it. This right here is the SAM. SAM stands for Super Awesome Blaster. It's also kind of a play on words because uh, Fowler's wife's name is uh, SAM. So, um, it is a sweet revenge. Um, and... There's some pretty serious modifications to the inside. The spring has been doubled and also spacered um, so that it operates well. Um, it has a hell of a draw on it and definitely not a blaster to be dry fired because the air restrictors have been removed. So even with a dart in it, it is still, you can hear, pretty loud. Um, it absolutely just shoots lasers. I have not done a range test on it, but this is actually a sister blaster to... Um, oh, and I also, I forgot, um, I am also including its five, five dart capacity with a five dart, uh, uh, reload, uh, that'll mount on the top. So, um, that's the whole blaster put together, um, a pretty serious, uh, dude here. Um, it is the sister to my Nancy Sinatra, um, this was my first modification of a, uh, a, a Sweet Revenge. Um, cosmetically, it's very similar. Um, this one has a duplicolor vinyl die um, base coat for the top, um, and then the detailing was done in um, acrylic. Um, you can see it says the Sam. Um, on the back here, I left them a little note in their phone from Evan B. Um, the handle uh, portion was done with a Duplicolor Vinyl Dye White uh, base and then a Krylon um, Silver Enamel. Um, then the whole thing, all the parts were um, matte clear coated. Um, and the pink and orange was left unpainted um, because I really like uh, the pink and orange. So it, t even though this is a black blaster um, or predominantly black blaster, um, it still has a very toy look to it. Um, the handle's been wrapped in uh, nylon webbing, the same as mine. Um, I would say everything about Fowler's blaster is cleaner than mine. You know, mine was the first attempt at this. So you can see like even the, the detailing and the painting was done much better. You know, I'm, I'm a tattoo artist, and so um, there's definitely some tattoo uh, uh, art aesthetic to this, um, which I think is cool on these blasters. It has kind of an Old West uh, uh, feel with the filigree. Um, man, it just absolutely has a ton of punch. Um, and, and mine does too, um, but the draw, uh, the, the air restrictor is still in this one in his... There's no, oh God, you just do not want to dry fire this. Please, dude, you will, uh, uh, I would hate for you to break it on yourself. So, um, that's the Sam. Um, I am super excited for him to get it. Um, it's going to come packaged in this blow no ammo case, uh, that I made. Uh, and I hope that he really enjoys it, man. I had a lot of fun making it, um, and, and he's been such a cool, uh, uh a cool dude about sending me stuff. Um, I'm really, really looking forward to him getting his hands on this and, uh, and hopefully he likes it. Hopefully the wife likes it and, uh, yeah, all, all in all, um, a super fun blaster to make. So Fala from Blow No Nerf, this one's for you, man. Uh, much love. Hey, peace and hair grease guys. Have a great night and nerf on.